Good morning, folks. It's Monday. Yay! Welcome to Droning On Live. Hit the subscribe button below if you love raw content straight from my Samsung S10 uploaded directly to YouTube with no editing and fancy silly intro credits or anything else. Anyway, interesting news today that warehousing is going to be using drones. So think of your big factories that are storing tons of goods and products and assets like Amazon and all the other big tech tech companies and distributors well they're looking to use drones to automate their processes now you may have seen the video we shared not long ago of the insider look at the dji factory where they actually produce the drones and it was quite incredible because the drones fly themselves through the factory and test themselves it's amazing if you haven't seen it it was a few videos back so go and have a look but basically they're looking to do that on a wider scale there's a company called where and an article in a website called Nan Nanalyze, good name. And basically they're talking about what Wear are doing in this space by using drones, specifically the Skydio 2, which of course is a very clever autonomous drone, very good at flying and avoiding objects, not very good at cinematography or cinematic drone footage in my opinion, but very good at not hitting things. And when you're flying indoors, that's key. Now what they're looking to do with drones is three things. Data collection, so the drone flying autonomously, capturing data on both bin locations and returning all of that data into one central data repository. Effectively, audit, making sure that they've got the products that they think they've got actually on the shelves. The next is data processing, so once the, they collect the data, they use machine learning algorithms to compute what the drone is actually seeing and interpret all of that. And then report delivery, so providing reports automatically to warehousing owners to say, what have we got, what haven't we got? This is very, very clever stuff. And they've actually just received $2.5 million in angel investment so that they can actually start really, really pushing this dynamic drone-driven inventory management system. Very, very clever stuff. Now, they're just basically starting out, but their, their vision is to implement this kind of technology into the 18,700 warehouses scattered across the United States of America initially, where they believe that they can do things better than manual control. Now, I guess the sad side effect of this is the warehouse workers. They are unfortunately the lower paid sector of employment, and by implementing drones, they're effectively removing the manual intervention. These jobs will disappear. That is sad to see because ultimately these workers you know they are the lower paid of the the spectrum and they need this money and it is sad when you do see machines robots replacing jobs like that but unfortunately that's just the the nature of life and innovation and evolution of the industrial space it probably means that eventually we'll all be replaced by robots even me at droning on you won't see me probably in 50 years time, you'll be pleased to hear, because I'll just be some 3D simulated face talking. <laughs> some of my viewers might prefer that. But anyway, it's very, very interesting to see this kind of innovation uh, regardless. And, you know, ultimately the advances here in the corporate and enterprise space do eventually cascade down to us, the consumers, by making our drones cheaper because the more drones they produce, whether it's for commercial or consumer sector, the cheaper it becomes, supply and demand and all of that. Interesting stuff. I'll put a link to this specific article in the video description. Have a read. Comment below, what do you think about this kind of drone innovation? Give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you'd like to see a virtual ash instead of the real ash. And hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.